and welcome back to my channel or welcome if you are new. If you are new and you like makeup, beauty, hair or hauls then please consider subscribing. So today is a bit of a different one for me because uh, it's reviewing an e-bike. So an e-bike is obviously an electric bike. Um, to be honest I, I don't know masses about this kind of thing. All I know is that it for me the main intention was to save money for petrol uh, because obviously petrol's blooming expensive now with the cost of living and everything. So it'll be nice to be able to save on that for short journeys. And obviously it's better for the environment as well. So I got mine from DYU Cycle, which is an online brand and it came really quick as well. It literally came in days, like five days, I think it was from the date of ordering. And the bikes on there are really affordable as well. I know that e-bikes, can you can be talking like thousands and thousands of pounds. Uh, the one that I chose, personally was only 700 euros or 699 so I thought that was a really good price because I wanted one with kind of like a basket on the front for storage and everything but yeah they do all different ones as well they do like fold up ones they do um like lightweight fold up ones and they do like more chunkier ones with bigger tires and things I believe that the most expensive one that they do is around 1500 euros so it's still very affordable for an e-bike so I chose this bike so this is a 26 inch city electric bike which comes in black or white uh yeah I chose the black one but yeah, I just really like the design of this one. It's quite feminine looking. Obviously, we've got the basket on the front, as I said before, for storage. You now you can put your shopping basket, your handbag and things in there. Yeah, which is pretty much perfect, to be quite honest with you. So this one has 30 to 37 miles per charge in pedal assist mode. With 15.5 miles per hour top speed, it's 36 volts, 12.5 AH lithium iron battery and as I say it's 26 inches so this one also has Shimano gears it's an LED headlight on there as well it has a rear rack as well that obviously you can you can put your own storage on there it's got stops hy hydraulic disc brakes on there for smoother stops uh, folding pedals and an adjustable seat the battery on the bike is fully removable as well so it's ever so easy I'll show you in a bit but you can just kind of take that off and just recharge it as and when you need it which is so handy and it also has a 350 watt high speed motor on it as well so this is my husband and I just starting off by unpacking the bike. It does come really well packaged, I will say that. It's perfectly packaged for transit. So just showing you what it also comes with. So as you probably saw there, it does actually come with a bike lock as well and it's quite a good one. Definitely took two of us to lift this out of the box. It is a weighty bike, it is heavy. So just taking off all the little bits of packaging, all the polystyrene bits, ready to assemble the bike. So as you can see, my husband's just popping their seat on here, which as I said before, it is fully adjustable. The only thing that I will say with regards to this is that you are gonna need your own tools because the tools that actually come with the bike aren't the best quality. Um, so yeah, a spanner in particular, you will definitely need. It does come with an instruction manual as well, which is pretty good actually. So my son had to come and step in and help out because he knows more about bikes than we do and uh, yeah to be honest he had the tools and the knowledge to uh, do it a lot better than we did. Just 
popping on the final parts now. So yeah, to be honest with you, apart from the tool issue, it was actually reasonably okay to assemble. It wasn't too difficult. Probably took us about an hour in total. So here is the bike all put up. I think it looks absolutely lovely. Really nice tires on it. You know, they're nice and thick. Beautiful frame. I love this kind of matte black look about it as well. A nice spongy seat as well, so it's nice and comfortable. As you can see, that's the bike lock on the bottom just there that comes with it. Got the light just there, obviously the basket. So that's the light there. It's actually really strong. It's like a, a car headlight almost. The Shimano gears there. So that's kind of like your, your throttle. <laughs> if you know what I mean, to uh, yeah, accelerate. And we've got a little horn on there as well. That's your light button for the front kind of headlight, should we say, and the back or the rear uh, bag rack. And then we also have a, a light at the back here as well, which has different modes on it. And this is the battery that I said you can uh, remove and charge up. So yeah, that's the battery on there. As you can see, it's got a little slot just here that you pop your key in. It's kind of like your ignition and your start stop on the back just there as well. So there we go, there is my new e-bike. Yeah, I really like it. I think it is a beautiful bike in itself, but you know, it's gonna save me money in the long run. So um, yeah, I'm really happy with it because petrol is, as I say, so expensive nowadays. So for short journeys, you know, to the shops and things like that, it's absolutely perfect. As always, I will pop the product in the description box below for you, along with any discount codes as well. Other than that, I hope you enjoyed watching. And if you did, please give me a thumbs up and I'd really appreciate it. It'd mean the absolute world to me. If you'd enjoy watching this video and you'd like to see more content from me in the future, and you would like to subscribe to my channel. Until then, thanks for watching.